Good morning, Lee Taylor from Avon Park Christian Church with today's devotional, which is entitled, Glorious Things. The psalmist wrote, Glorious things are said of you. John Newton was once a slave trader. After becoming a Christian, he became a powerful preacher, a leader in the fight against slavery, and also a famous hymn writer. One of his hymns contains these glorious things. He whose word cannot be broken. This reminds us of the faithfulness of God, a centerpiece of the Psalms. In Psalm after Psalm, we hear the echo of God's faithfulness giving strength, hope, and encouragement to the children of Israel. Though they often abandoned God and at times paid a dear price for forsaking Him, he was there every time they called on him and immediately answered their cry. Continuing, well supply thy sons and daughters and all fears of wants removed. There was never a time in their history that God did not feed them, go before them, or watch over them. When they looked to him for forgiveness and repented of their sinful ways, his mercies met them at their point of need, and His blessings followed. He was with them to meet their needs, remove their fear, and grant them the desires of their heart. Continuing, grace which, like the Lord, the giver, never fails from age to age. If there ever was a time in, his, in the history of our nation that we needed to be reminded that God's grace would never fail, it is now. Everywhere we look, we see a need for His love, mercy, grace, salvation, and our nation's restoration. It is not His glory that has vanished. It is our unwillingness to share His grace with others. Our scripture for today is from Psalm 87, 3, Glorious things of thee are spoken. Our prayers, Lord, how disappointed you must be when you see what we can do to share your grace, yet do nothing. Forgive us, we pray, in Jesus' name. Amen.